any idea what this is? Well, that's what we're going to try and figure out today on this edition of What the Heck is That? Welcome to What the Heck is That? The new gadget game show. Steve Greenberg, um, the author of Gadget Nation. I also appear routinely on NBC's Today Show, showcasing new products, also on a bunch of TV stations around the country doing the same thing. And that's what this game is all about, new products. And let's meet our panelists for this game show. We've got our panelists over here. We've got uh, Lois Whitman Hess, who has worked uh, in the world of public relations for more than 40 years. Her agency, HWHPR, has launched hundreds of new products. She also writes a very popular daily blog, DigiDame, which I read every day, and co-hosts the podcast, Lying on the Beach. Welcome, Lois. Hi. Hi, thank you. Okay, and next we've got Harry Redlick, who before social distancing, Harry was a uh, very busy actor in the South Florida theater scene. He's a filmmaker, published writer, and former advertising executive director. Harry is currently learning to play the ukulele. And maybe later he'll give us a little demonstration of that. Next we have up is Oliver Tull. I've known Oliver for a while. He's the actor, comedian, talk show host with 10,000 shows to his credit. And he's currently to be heard as host of the podcast, Improv, by instinct. Oliver, thank you for joining us. Hey, I just want to let you know, I have no idea what anything is. <laughs> That's what makes you perfect for this, perfect. And last, but certainly not least, in a different background, we've got Tara Harper. She's the co-founder and spokesperson of Blushy, a beauty accessories line, and often seen showcasing her company's products on QVC. She's surrounded by roses because this past weekend, Tara got married in a Zoom wedding. I was there, and Tara, you, you've given up part of your honeymoon to be with us, and we're, we're honored. Oh, I gave it my whole honeymoon to be with you. <laughs> oh, really? oh, really? This is it? Okay, well. This is it. And, you, and, you, and I love the background. The flowers are great. Thank okay, you. so let's, let's go over the rules for the folks at home. Here are the rules. Uh, each panelist gets three questions, yes or no. If they, if they get a no, they forfeit the rest of their questions and they move on to the next panelist. Now, after we've finished all the questions, we'll go through to see what the panelists have guessed regarding the product. What is it? What does it do? What makes it unique? And maybe you at home will be guessing as well. So let's go first up. I'm gonna click right here to uh, Harry. I'm gonna give you a little, everybody's gonna get a little look at the product for a second. I'm gonna walk over here and just kind of show you it. This is one side of it. You can open it and see it looks like this on the inside. You close it up, it looks like this. And there are no clues on this product. Sometimes I'll have clues. This one, no clue. Harry, the pressure's on right now. You've got three questions. What's your first question regarding this mystery gadget? What do you think it is? Is this uh, a gadget that I would use in my home? Hmm. Yeah, you might. You might use it in your home. You might. I'll give that as a yes. Uh, would I also use it outside in, uh, in the outside environment? I think you're more likely to use it outside than you would inside your home, but you could use it in both places. Would I use this... Uh, in my car? I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think so. I would say, I, I mean, it could be, I mean, you can use anything anywhere, but I don't think that's its primary focus. I think it's even more... If I'm on a, even if I'm on a road trip to Vegas? Well, then maybe. <laughs> so, I mean, anything happens on Vegas. It's possible. I, I would give you a, a, a semi-yes on that. So it's, it's definitely not a no. Okay, let's move over to um, Lois. Whitman Hess, she's worked in PR business for quite, you know, a few years now. She's seen a lot of products. Lois, give me your three questions. What's your first question? Would this be something in the category of to power something? It could. Yeah. Is that a yes or a no? I'll give you a yes. It's not, a, it's not I'll give you this. It's not its primary role but it is part of it, yes. Okay. 
Um, do you require any electricity to use this product? Yes, you do. Okay. Um, does this product cost less than $50? Uh, no, it does not. Hmm. Okay. But that was a good question. Okay. You've got some great information there. We're moving on to, I guess we'll go to Oliver next. Oliver, what okay. are your three questions? Hmm. Number one, is it legal to transport this across state lines? <laughs> yes, it is. Great question. Yes, it is. Uh, do I need a partner to use this? <laughs> no, no. You can use this by yourself. Uh-huh. And mm. third, do I is this eligible for coupon or groupon use? At this moment, no. At this moment, no. But good question. Okay. Okay. Tara, it's all on you now. You've got three questions. You're a maven in the gadget world. Tell me your thoughts. What's your first question? Is it something having to do you use an iPhone? Does it use an iPhone or have anything to do with an iPhone? It can be used with an iPhone, so I'll give that a yes. Okay. Do you but not need, exclusively. Do you need sunlight for it? Oh, it, sunlight is a factor. Very good question. Yes, yes. Sunlight does it does work well with sunlight. Okay. Hmm. I'm trying to look and see. It comes in other colors. I was actually going to ask that because it's really cute. Um, it is, cute. is it waterproof? No, it's not. But luckily, that was your third question. So now you've heard all the questions, the answers. You get a few moments here to think about the choices. I, I'm going to play the thinking music. Do, 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 do. But I don't think I can do any more than that because of copyright issues. So I can do less than 15 seconds of it. Okay. I think we'll go to Harry first. What's your guess, Harry? Let's see. I'm still writing. I'm not a fast Okay. Writer. Oh, oh. Was, that's I all right. So, I was penalized I that in grades. I know that we don't do uh, that here. This, this, in this homeschooling environment, there are no, everybody gets a trophy. Oh, good. Okay, I have it. Ready? Okay, Harry, go first. Solar-powered air conditioner. Solar-powered air conditioner. Personal air conditioner. Personal air conditioner. No, but a good guess. Okay, but hang on there. Next, we go to Lois. What's your guess? Uh-oh, she's going to know. I have this feeling. She, I can tell in her face. <laughs> what, what, no, below your chin. Below your chin or you disappear. Oh, a question mark. She doesn't know. She fooled me on that one. Okay, I thought you I thought you knew it. I had that feeling that you knew it. Okay, uh, Oliver, what's your guess? I believe that is what we call a solar-powered bread box. You keep your bread <laughs> in it. That's the stuff. Hmm, interesting. And and actually, that would be that might be next week's uh, product. But okay, that's very good. But not, not it. But you're 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 all kind of warm, uh, except for Lois. Okay, Tara, what's your guess? <laughs> solar charger for the phone probably the closest to winning and let me show you what the product is this is really sort of a combination of all those things with the word combination being critically important because this is called the beach safe you see it's got a, a lock right there oh, what a good idea. you then put this in yeah you put this through here and it locks well, through this part here and then you can wrap this part around your chair or whatnot and then it's solar powered it's just, it gets sun right here and the solar powered part charges this battery so you can then charge your devices inside here plus it has a mini fan so it will keep your devices cool while they're at the beach so it's a beach oh. safe that cools your products and you can charge them up using the sun that's wow. it that's it and as Lois asked the price, it's $79. Oh. Pretty cool, huh? That's a yeah. Okay. So, the I closest know that we Lois, have to... 
Lois is yeah. always taking her jewels to the beach. So I think that she really appreciates that. Actually, if you know Lois, she's never without seven or eight devices. So that she would need two or three of them at the beach because she's got so many devices. So I would say that would be the, the, the thing with her. But I think this, so, so this is one episode. We're going to have more episodes, but I want to thank all of you. And, and basically, you know, you're playing for what are you winning? My respect and admiration, which you've all got <laughs> on this one. So congratulations on that. Okay, next time we'll have another mystery gadget and we'll be asking a question. What the heck is that? What the we'll heck? Be is that? What the heck is that? Thank you all. We'll, we'll, Thank you. we'll be back with another one. Thank you.